This video explains how to connect your profiler and turn it on. First, firmly insert the power adapter into a wall power outlet. Next, insert the power cable into the power port on the profiler marked plus 12 VDC. When using a MIDI cable with the profiler, make sure you align the five pins on the MIDI cable with the five holes on the MIDI connector. For your first MIDI cable, connect it to the profiler. The other end of this MIDI cable should be connected to the MIDI out port of your instrument. This cable allows the MIDI out messages from your device to reach the profiler. Connect the second cable to the profiler's MIDI out port. Connect the other end of this MIDI cable to your instrument's MIDI in port. This allows the MIDI messages being played back from the profiler to reach your instrument. The MIDI through port is a copy of all the MIDI messages that are received in the MIDI in port on the profiler. Next, grab the USB that came with the profiler, remove the cap, and insert it into the connector marked USB. Although the profiler may work with most standard USB flash drives, the only drive that has been tested and approved is the device drive that came with the profiler. You are now ready to turn on the profiler. Please press the button marked on off so that it is pushed in. A splash screen will be displayed showing the current version of firmware on the profiler. Then the main menu will be displayed. Your profiler is now ready to use. Please view the rest of the instructional videos for more information.